hello guys welcome back to my channel so in this video we are going to learn about the pagination and filter and sort in the bitbucket api so in my previous video we have seen like how to create an access token how to create access token using refresh token and we have worked with the bitbucket apis that is user api and the repository apis so in this tutorial we are going to learn how we can apply the pagination and sorting and the filter in the bitbucket api so quickly open the uh, bitbucket api documentation i will open pagination and the filter so uh, this was my uh, request token in the uh, in the, which we have created in a previous video i will just again hit this api to generate a new access token because the previous access token might get expired so you can see yes so this access token is expired now so i will just create a new one with the help of refresh token then invalid refresh token exchange so what we gonna do we gonna I will just log in my bitbucket account here and we are going to create new bitrefresh token. I'll just quickly create that. got the code you will create a new access token using the code and the key exchange yes we got the new access token now. We will just click it. Okay, this is working now. So what we'll do, we will just copy this code to the screen. and we will just pass Okay. Now we have a repository list. Now, if you see that the size of the repository is 15 and the page length is 10, so currently there are only 10 records. So I'll just copy this and I'll show you. So if you see there are 10 records here and the total size is 15. Now what we are going to do, we are going to apply some pagination to it. I will just put on to and just apply. So we will just 
jump into the bucket of yes. And yeah, the pig. Here is the pig. The pig is and the pig is the pig. Is the pig. Now, if you see the pig total size is gone, now we got the previous URL instead of the next URL. We will see how much the code are there. And now you can see there are 5 epochs only. Now again if you want to apply a sorting to it, you can do that as well. So there is So there are a lot of sorting over there. So if you want to be sorted on the updated on you see like the latest updated repository should be first. So we can apply the sorting over here. And I'm just using the definition for now. And then step six. Copy this. So by default this sort is done by the uh, big bucket only like uh, the latest updated one so you might not have see any changes in it okay now you can see that the repository is started the last created that was sorry just the updated was 2058 5 and here was the 2018 4 10 2028 5 and 2024 10 so this was the latest updated one so uh, by using this you can you know sort there are multiple parameters in the uh, bucket you can apply those things as per your requirement and you can apply the filter and sort and the page generation is uh, very simple they provide a next and previous url as well so that you don't need to worry about it okay so i hope this will help you guys thank you thank you so much for watching